What's up, gentlemen? Welcome to another episode of Intelligence. You can't be everyone's cup of tea. Not all men are born with a natural talent for getting back with an epic clapback when some toxic guy tries to insult them. Of course, not all fights are worth it, but it is sure handy to know a few rebuttals to let someone know you're not one to mess with. In today's video, we're teaching you how to respond to an insult, and most importantly, what to do when someone insults you. Today's episode is inspired by Charisma on Command's video, where he shared some of the best comebacks for when people insult you. By the end of this video, we'll also be sharing some tips on how you can take care of yourself esteem to help you keep afloat in this world of critics. If you want to know how to handle insults and how to be more confident, keep watching. Number five, for when someone tells you how to live your life. We've all been advised to be the nice guy and take the high road when someone tries to insult us, to keep the peace, but sometimes ignoring the disrespect just breeds more disrespect. There will come a time when you tell yourself, no more Mr. Nice Guy, and decide to actually do something about these clowns. And if that time is now, one of the savage ways to respond is to flip the script. According to licensed marriage and family therapist, Saba Haruni Lori, asking a what question shifts the dynamic and forces the offending party to think or rethink, you can respond with the question of your own that highlights the absurdity or tactlessness of their words, explains Lori. Here's what to do when someone insults you. Take their word. Make it seem like you agree with the troll? Flip the script and throw it back in their face. Let's say some airhead had the audacity to put you in the spotlight and humiliate you in front of people by discrediting you or criticizing how you live your life. An example of a good response would be, I'd agree with you, but then we'd both be wrong. Or you could say, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize that you were an expert on my life and how I should live it. Please continue. I'll take notes. Or finish him with, you're entitled to your incorrect opinion. According to Lori, by flipping the script, you might just prompt them to consider their intention and the harm caused, even if their purpose wasn't to cause damage. Tired of being the good guy? Make sure you don't finish last by watching this video where we share 10 powerful ways to be an alpha man. Number four, for when someone tries to take a hit on how you look. It's probably clear to you by now that today we woke up and chose violence. Everybody loves being flattered, but no one likes getting backhanded compliments, especially about your appearance. By the way, it's never okay to comment on anyone's appearance because 100% of the time, they're already aware of it. If you do that, it's probably one of the reasons why girls think you're unattractive. Anyway, if you have no idea how to respond to an insult or how to deal with rude people, psychiatrist Neil Burton said that if you're going to return an insult, your comebacks have to be clever, cutting, and occur to you just at the right time. If you have no idea what to say when someone insults you, think of lines such as, if you ran like your mouth, you'd be in good shape. If I had a face like yours, I'd sue my parents. Or, hey, you have something on your chin. No, the third one down. Fire with fire, baby. Easy. Guys, does it seem like you repel women? Watch this video where we break down all of the reasons girls think you're unattractive. Number three, for when someone's trying to be funny. What do trolls, clowns, and fools have in common? they all think they're funny, as if that would get people or a girl to instantly like them. If you've ever wondered what to do when someone insults you, just join in the fun and humor them back. According to psychiatrist Neil Burton, if successful, humor can be an especially effective response for three main reasons. It undercuts the insulter and their insult brings any third parties on their side and diffuses the tension of the situation. American actress Ilka Chase, for example, after writing a number of novels, received an anonymous comment from a fellow actress saying, I enjoyed reading your book. Who wrote it for you? To which Chase replied, Darling, I'm so glad you liked it. Who read it to you? So the next time a hater tries to diss you and says you talk like an idiot, reply with, Of course I talk like an idiot. How else could you understand me? Or, It sounds like a you problem. And that's how to deal with insults. If it's entertaining for them, it'll make it more entertaining for you. In case you're curious, watch this video to learn how to get girls to instantly like you. Guys, we're down to our last two items in this list of epic ways to respond to an insult. But before we continue teaching you how to respond to an insult and what to do when someone insults you, I just want to remind you that by the end of this video, we're also sharing tips on how you can take care of your self-esteem to help you keep afloat in this world of critics. So stay tuned. Number two, for when someone tries to brush off an insult with, just kidding. Don't you just hate when someone insults you and follows it up with, just kidding, or I'm only joking, as if those words somehow magically make their comments less annoying. The thing is, these guys use remarks like this as a free pass to be jerks, and I can't let you be okay with that. If you're wondering how to respond to an insult, another way to do it is address it head on. This is especially appropriate when you know the behavior is intentionally hurtful. Remember that most people are good at evading or misdirecting a confrontation, so you must be prepared to make your point no matter how they respond. If you let them control the situation, you'll likely fall into their trap of escalating the situation and look like the instigator. What are some good replies, you might ask? Well, when someone calls you boring, you could respond with, yeah, and what makes you so exciting? Or you could say, you have an entire life to be an idiot. Why not take today off? 
And if he tries to play the victim, backfire with, oh, you don't like being treated the way you treat me? That must suck. Number one, for when someone is passive aggressive. Another way to respond to an insult is through the questioning technique. If someone is being passive aggressive towards you, the questioning technique will force that person to justify and support their statement. One important thing to remember about passive aggressive people is that they hate explaining. Why? Because it pressures them to take responsibility for their statements. Examples of great follow up questions are Oh, why do you say that? That's interesting. Can you tell me more? What do you mean by that? I'm not sure I understand. Can you explain? Now that you know how to respond to an insult and what to do when someone insults you, it's time to teach you how to raise your self esteem. So you remain unbothered even with all the trolls around you. The first step to boosting your self-esteem is to identify the negative beliefs you have about yourself. Then challenge them. This way, if someone tries to attack you with criticism, your confidence wouldn't crumble to pieces. You may tell yourself you're too stupid or unattractive. Start to note these negative thoughts and ask yourself when you first started to think about these thoughts. Next, list evidence that challenges these negative beliefs such as, I am talented, I am a work in progress, or I am unique and there's no one like me. You can also write some good things that other people say about you. Recognizing your strengths and weaknesses and learning how to work with them and love yourself is the most effective way to improve your confidence. How about you guys? How do you respond to an insult? Go ahead and share your thoughts in the comment section below. And that is it in this list of epic ways to respond to an insult. Remember, an entire sea of water can't sink a ship unless it gets inside the ship. Sometimes you need to be strong and not be the nice guy. Watch this video to know how.